If on a little physical activity your breathing is short and rapid and your lips or skin turns blue. If your mind is confused and cannot focus on a single point. If your heartbeat is very fast and usually blood pressure is high. Often you feel exhausted and weak with a mild headache. Sometimes you stand from ground and you feel dizziness or lightheadedness. There is a mild chest pain on left side and your body muscles do not respond as you wish then you might be deficient in oxygen but don't worry here are some proven strategies to boost oxygen level in your body follow them and see the results in days well start deep breathing exercises such as diaphragmatic breathing and pranayama that engage the diaphragm and stimulate the parasympathetic nervous system this promote relaxation reduce stress and enhance lung capacity when you take slow deep breaths you increase the exchange of oxygen and carbon dioxide in the lungs leading to improved oxygenation of the blood Well, do engage yourself in regular physical activities because they are essential for cardiovascular health. Exercise increases the heart rate, improving the efficiency of blood circulation. As the heart pumps faster, more oxygen-rich blood is delivered to tissues, muscles, and organs, and here is increased oxygenation. Drink plenty of water. Well, staying hydrated is vital for maintaining the viscosity of blood. Proper blood viscosity ensures that red blood cells can flow easily through blood vessels promoting efficient oxygen transport. Well, the nutrients such as iron, B vitamins and antioxidants play key roles in maintaining healthy oxygen levels. Iron is a crucial component of hemoglobin, the protein responsible for binding to oxygen in red blood cells. Consuming iron-rich foods such as lean meats, spinach and lentils supports the production of functional hemoglobin. On the other hand, B vitamins are involved in red blood cell formation and energy metabolism, ensuring that oxygen is efficiently transported and utilized. and antioxidants found in fruits and vegetables protect red blood cells from damage allowing them to function effectively in oxygen transport watch our upcoming video on foods that boost oxygen and you will get more deep insight do sleep 8 to 10 hours in a single shot during sleep your body undergo essential processes for maintaining optimal health including oxygen regulation Sleep allows your body to repair and rejuvenate, optimizing oxygen uptake and utilization. Do spend your time in fresh air like parks or open areas. Spending time in well-ventilated areas and having indoor plants can improve air quality. Plants release oxygen during photosynthesis, increasing oxygen levels in the surrounding environment. This can have a positive impact on indoor air quality, enhancing the oxygen content you breathe in and support better oxygenation of your body's tissues. Well, stress is your enemy. Keep in mind, chronic stress can lead to shallow breathing and reduced oxygen intake. Stress management techniques such as meditation, yoga and mindfulness help reduce stress hormones and promote relaxation ultimately boost oxygen levels in the body maintaining good posture while sitting and standing is essential for maximizing lung capacity and oxygen exchange when you have proper posture your lungs have more space to expand fully allowing for efficient oxygen intake Tobacco smoke and environmental pollutants can damage lung tissue and decrease lung capacity. Smoking restricts the airways, making it harder for oxygen to reach the bloodstream. Pollutants can also irritate the respiratory system, leading to inflammation and decreased oxygen exchange. By avoiding smoking and minimizing exposure to pollutants, you can protect your lungs and ensure efficient oxygen uptake. Well altitude training involves exposing yourself to higher altitudes where oxygen levels are lower this challenges your body to adapt for producing more red blood cells a process known as erythropoiesis with increased red blood cell production your blood's oxygen carrying capacity improves enhancing oxygen delivery to tissues and muscles however altitude training should be approached cautiously and gradually to avoid negative health effects remember small changes in lifestyle can have a significant impact on your well-being Thank you for joining us like share and subscribe for more informative content